This looks like our room. Oh, am I interrupting? <laughs> Welcome <laughs> to our standard view room at Disney's Wilderness Lodge. We're in room 2006, right? Yes. That's it. Okay. Yeah, 2600. <laughs> so we're on the second floor. 2006 is what it is. <laughs> we're on the second floor. I really love this room. So these rooms were just recently updated within the past year. So I'm really excited about it. So starting right here on this side, you have a closet and I like that you can like shed it and it, I don't know. Do that it has I mean? door? You like that it has doors? <laughs> no, I like that I can shed it, almost slam it and it like. Oh, catches you know itself, I mean? yeah. Yeah, isn't that cool? Okay, don't bang your water bottle on the mirror, okay? All right. <laughs> Anyway, you've got but, your hangers, you've got your pillow and blanket. <laughs> it's kind of where, and you've got your yes. little thing for your luggage. So that's where all that's located. And then this Swing is right another here. portion of the closet. Um, we put Steamer, some steamer. Our... You've got your. <laughs> <laughs> Can we not both be talking at the same time? <laughs> you've got your steamer. You've got your safe for all your nefarious items. Anyway, lots of storage in here. So. That's very nice because I have started to enjoy unpacking in our room, which has been really nice. So anyway, um, bathroom. Well, no, no, no. First, the sliding door um, has a full length mirror on it. So, so you can like, see your full self. This is the real deal right here. I mean, this door is and it like, seems like it kind of clicks not messing around. Into place. Yeah, it does click. I was noticing that while Ellie was napping. I think I woke her up when this door clicked shut. Anyway, so, PSA. <laughs> you know, it is what it is. Um, and then beautiful bathroom. We've already kind of, you know, set up our things. Andy needed to see a little bit of extra. Um, of himself in the mirror so we yeah the stool for i him. love to look at myself in the mirror so he just needs like an elevated yes body shot so <laughs> but you have uh both sinks and then not a ton of storage like i mean this is like gives you like a good four inches right here so i don't know what you would really use that's that a generous for. five so i yeah i don't know but um these one tiny roll. little nooks like I don't know what you would put in there. It definitely couldn't fit like a toiletry bag or anything. So mm, I'm not, not quite yours. sure, <laughs> but you do have this additional ledge up here. Um, and then this thing is so cool. So yeah, show the people. I know it lights up. Isn't that so cool? It's pretty neat. I don't know. It makes it feel very spa like in here. Really? I mean, I think so. Like the granite stone and the, you know, I don't know. It's cool. It just looks like stained glass. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> it's the first then, time she's seen stained glass, everybody. Give her a break. Okay. All right. Well, I was going to try to pull this out, but I don't even think I can. So <laughs> yeah, she's fine motor skills are problematic sometimes, <laughs> but this does shut right here. Um, and then you have the tub shower combo, which we've clearly already used with my three year old. We came yes. back from the pool earlier, but. But um, pretty nice. Like, beautiful shower. Like, beautiful shower. Great shower head, everything. So, very nice. And then you have this little kitchenette area. Well, I can't really call it a kitchenette because the only thing. That's you not have, fair to call it a kitchenette. It's not a kitchenette. It's just some extra storage space. Your curing machine, an ice bucket, some counter space. And then coffee mugs, glasses, um, you know, extra to-go cups, yeah, all we'll, of your we'll coffee, talk about, we'll talk about this one like, coffee essentials that we will not be using. We don't, um, we don't partake of we the Joff. <laughs> um, calling this a kitchenette would be like calling your 10 year old a teenager. It's just not, it's not quite, true. not quite there. Yeah. Um, and then a beverage cooler. So um, this is not an actual refrigerator, which really stinks. So it kind of affects how we do groceries and food. So we brought stuff to make our own PB and J's for my toddler because Uncrustables is just, there's no way to keep them frozen they don't stay in here. Fresh in there. Um, and they don't stay fresh. So um, anyway, we have some fruit, yogurt that, you know, might be good for a couple of days <laughs> and then lots of water, but that's pretty much it for the beverage cooler. Um, and then moving into the actual bedroom, two queen beds and then i really like that you have this ledge on each side 
So you know how much of a pain that is when it's a huge like, pain. One of us gets the side with the. It's usually uh, me. It's usually you, and I'm like, you want to switch sides, and nope. you're like, no, I know what you want. Like, you want the ledge. For well, then, your phone. and then every other time we travel, <laughs> like she's like, nope, stick to your side of the bed, because every on my side. <laughs> married couple cannot switch sides. God forbid you switch sides one night. <laughs> oh my gosh! And then you've got the other spa, like. I know uh, it's on both on sides. The They're not connected though, so you can have it on in the bathroom. But it doesn't have to be on out here, so I don't know if you want that ambiance in the middle. Of the you good, bro? <laughs> you good? Okay. So anyway, and then you know <clears throat> your little reading lights. Oh, you crossword fanatics can stay up late and do crosswords. You know, yeah, while the rest of your family sleeps, so that's very nice. Um, and then lots of space underneath the bed, so our luggage is under the bed right now, so that's really nice that we just have a little bit more space to kind of spread out with the new elevated beds. Um, and then of course, lots of outlets and USBs and you know, all the things, we've got lots of things to charge, you know, camera equipment, fans, I don't know. Kids tablet. Charger, her tablet, yeah. you know, all Our, the things. Ourselves. <laughs> Um, if you ever want to wake up, just stick a finger in a socket real quick. What? Pro tip. So, and then, you know, more outlets and USBs on this side behind that as well. Um, and we've actually unpacked a little bit. So what I like to do is I have all of this in a packing cube. And then when we are ready to go, all I do is fold this over, zip it up and put it right back in my suitcase. So. Let it be known, as you guys are seeing this for the first time, so am I. <laughs> you haven't seen that yet? No. You didn't know I did that? Nope. Well, there you go. So. You, you learn things. I know. Um, and then some cute little chairs right here. Um, and then this little table, which this pulls out. So if you need a little extra space, or if you want to get your dinner to go back in your room, or I don't know. It's just, you know, nice to have a little extra space, more lights. So, and I think this is where we're going to set up your coffee. 164 percent, right okay. yes. Yeah. Um, and then I'm really excited about this view for it being a standard view room. I was fully expecting like a maintenance building or a parking lot or something. So this is actually really, really nice. <laughs> I locked it. Of course. <laughs> I always try to prepare myself. Okay. <laughs> I would call this a standard plus view. <laughs> I mean, this is a great standard view. Like, look at this. I know. So you see the entrance to the cabins right here. And then around this corner, I mean, if you like, no, you can't really see it, but through the trees. Here, let me just step over real quick. Okay. Oh, I'm kidding. Do not drop my phone. <laughs> if you kind of look through the trees, you can I was going to step over the rail. You can see the water, but you can absolutely hear the boats. The boats are pretty loud, but not like obnoxiously loud we've had the doors shut and we couldn't hear them but when they're open it's a real nice you know little ambiance thing and you can hear the train from magic kingdom you might be able to hear it now it's going i can barely hear it yeah i was really surprised i was like is that the train at magic kingdom i didn't think we were that close enough to be able to hear it but apparently we are so it's kind of cool you can hear the train and the boat and you know and then i don't know what this little area is but it's like another little pond lake area i don't know bring your uh, fishing rods kids so <laughs> i don't know all the way over here <laughs> no gosh she's never fished a day in her life <laughs> i don't even know what these movements it's, are i don't know it looks like you're playing so, the bongos anyway, but um she's got a couple maracas over there <laughs> yeah so anyway yeah, this is an awesome view. I mean, for a standard view, this is really, really nice. Very serene, very peaceful, you know, sipping your coffee, listening to the boats, you know, it's pretty nice. Oh, I love you. <laughs> you went up there. Oh, no, that's dangerous. Go inside. Come on. <laughs> All right, well. <laughs> She's trying to cut me out of her life. That wraps it up for our standard view room here at the Wilderness Lodge. I am so excited for this week. Make sure that you are subscribed to the channel so you can catch all of our trip vlogs coming this week. And I cannot wait to take you guys along. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye.